all right guys so welcome back to another video so this morning i received this for testing and i'm gonna be doing a review it's a swing and grip trainer it's something that i've seen a lot online on social media and basically it's something that you can use to improve your tempo of your swing this is something that can really help you with your swing so make sure to stay tuned for the review called the warm-up swing and grip trainer I'll put all the details on the description below uh, you probably seen this it's online I don't know if this is the original brand but uh, I will review it today I'll do a little unboxing um, it comes in a nice box and it's pretty standard no instructions just the device here and let's have a look it looks pretty it's a uh, it's not light and basically uh, there's the grip trainer and there's a ball on the end. You're supposed to grip it with this right here. Uh, it's a line for like a almost strong grip. Not a weak grip definitely. So you just grab it and then you take some swings and you have to hear the click. You see there? If you hear, there's no click. So that's not click. So I have to go a little more. That's not it. You have to hear the click. So like that. So it feels like almost you have to like go faster on the downswing so by like that turn and go faster on the downswing so that's pretty neat uh, if you don't do it right it's not going to click if you do it very slow uh, so yeah you can also do it slow but you, as long as you have the right tempo i would advise using a glove as well so that way you can get used to the right grip exactly it's marked there very conveniently and uh, just have to turn and go. That's pretty good. That's pretty neat, actually. That didn't do it right, see? It's gonna force you to do it right. Go a little faster. There we go. So I don't like three, I get two right. So it takes some time to get used to it, I guess. You have to really swing it because otherwise it's not gonna click. Check. And it has to be not only the speed, but the right tempo. So that's, that is, it's a good product, I would say. So there we go. That was really strong there. Yeah. So basically what it wants you to do is just to go down uh, slow in your backswing and just come down a little faster. Okay. So I think for someone who's struggling with their turn, this will work really good because you have to turn and then release. So you have to go like that that didn't click there so after turn and then release properly so uh, not only in encourage you to turn properly but also to make sure to release properly because if i don't release properly like that it's just not going to click so i have to like finish basically yeah so i just have to finish my my swing exactly I think it could be used uh, to leave in your back and do as uh, use it as warm up as well because again you have to swing and you can you can do this little nice little slow swings right here with this one you have to really get into it and release so this is how it works it stretches out i don't know how sturdy this is going to be it looks pretty sturdy the bow is pretty nice as well too but um i suppose that it has to be sturdy because it's going to have a lot of stress every time going like that back and forth back and forth you have to release from here like that it's much easier to do with one hand you definitely feel the you feel what you have to do the thing that i want to add is that you can also use this indoors because if you use a real club obviously you can cause damages indoor with this right here it only um extends for a certain time so like i want to do it extends right there and then it retracts again so say if you have a high ceiling there it's not gonna it's not gonna go all the way up so you can actually be in a, a confined area and you can get a good practice here so you can do that and it will all extend right here get the clicking right guys because it's not that easy i'm telling you so it just shows me that i need to work on that there we go all right guys so that was it for the review of the swing and grip trainer uh make sure to check out the link below 
on the description, uh, something that you can definitely include in your bag. You can also use it at home, indoors, outdoors, in your backyard. So it's quite interesting. I've seen it a lot, again, on social media and a lot of coaches recommend it. So I think the best way to use it is to keep it in your bag and use it before you start hitting shots. So if you go to the range, instead of starting with your 52 or 60 degree wedge, Try this, warm up a little bit. Uh, you start hitting the clicks because it, um, it takes time. You're not gonna hear the clicks right away. So you have to you know, warm up your muscles. And with this, I think it's better rather than uh, hit shots right away. I think it will help you better uh, from the start. And then you can uh, start hitting shots with actual balls. So definitely highly recommend it, guys. Make sure to check out the link below. So I hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching. Until next time.